tomorrow night at town meeting, we have uh, several articles, I think there might be 16, Kevin, if I'm wrong, 16, some of which may or may not be moved. Um, if I had my way, we wouldn't move any of them. Um, if I had my way, we wouldn't be having a special town meeting tomorrow night. Is, uh, there are requests to spend $136,000, um, and it's a mixed bag of what it, uh, what it represents, anywhere from $3,000 to pay for uh, for looking into uh, employees' uh, job descriptions and, and money for police cruises. Um, most of the money that's being requested is money that we had uh, anticipated uh, maybe looking at. Um, back in April, we said we didn't have the money at that particular point in time, but if we did have money, uh, come the fall, then we'd have a town meeting and we'd consider whether or not we want to actually move forward. Um, now, here we are in October and we have a town meeting scheduled and there's $136,000 roughly that's available. Um, and we have requests that fill that $136,000 that's available. But obviously, given the current economic conditions and what's going on in Washington and, and what's going on uh, in our own neighborhoods, um, people are struggling and it's going to get worse it's going to get really bad. And we are moving into uh, the winter months where people are really just starting to see their first oil bill, some of which that haven't even paid off the oil bills from last year. So given that, I, I, think, it's, uh, I think it behooves everyone uh, that will attend town meeting tomorrow if they actually show up and we get a quorum um, to think long and hard before they want to vote for spending anything. Um, I think at this point, we were short $400,000. We have 136 now. That's not extra money. That's only 136 out of the 400 that we were short. And next year is not going to be any better. As a matter of fact, if you listen to the radio and the news and you listen to the governor coming forward, and there's quite a good chance that we, I, I, I'd hate to think that they might come back to take some of the state aid that they are they already promised us, but, but who knows? But there's not going to be more money next year. Uh, I, I tend to believe that there's probably going to be a lot less for us from the state and we're going to probably end up having cuts. So to spend this $136,000 now is, is wrong, and we should hold off. Um, like I said, the, uh, the town meeting has been posted. If, people, if enough people show up, we can actually hold it. Um, if enough people don't show up, we don't have to hold it. But I, honestly, I, I'm not asking people to stay home <laughs> because you have every right to come and debate whether or not we should move forward. Uh, that's the democratic way, and we'd like to see that happen. But uh, uh, to think that we might have the opportunity to actually have people voting um, tomorrow's your chance. If you don't want to spend that money, you have to come to town meeting. Um, either that or guarantee not enough people show up. So that's, uh, that's all I had to say. I, I don't want to spend any money. Uh, it's not a good time. We need to think about the future and, and there's nothing, nothing on the, uh, on the warrant that we'd be spending money on that's, that's crucial or critical to, uh, to the operation of the town. So let's, uh, let's see what happens tomorrow night.